Welcome back, everybody. We were just passing food over the internet, and now we're back. It's all good. Nobody died. No. Yeah. Kind of weird. You guys have been way too weird. You guys are oh, way too advanced busy. The internet. No, no. <laughs> just way too busy bickering amongst yourselves, building up your characters, which is awesome. <laughs> <laughs> that way, we will feel no pity when you all die. I mean, I mean, we'll feel all the pity when you all die. Never mind. That's what I meant. <laughs> so, when we last left our heroes, Joe's character, uh, which one was that, Joe? Murray? Oh, Sean. Sean. I'm sorry, getting your characters mixed up. But um. Sean... Sean is maybe going to prove a point by sleeping in the mm. nurse's I like this idea. I kind of like this idea. Meanwhile, um, Leo's secondary character, yes. <laughs> I forgot to say, uh, poor, old, uh, poor old Daphne <laughs> is in the rain with her booze. T-shirt just soaking wet, yep. walking off. White so, T-shirt. Yeah, of course. I am not wearing bra. Yeah. It's all fan service, boys and girls. Mm-hmm. Oh, we also noticed that, you know, like um that uh, that Sean is um uh, is kind of ripped and buff too as he takes his shirt off. Except he's still scraggly looking and kinda ugly. Mm-hmm. Ah so <laughs> the body's good. Scraggly so, looking and ugly yet still somehow buff. It's weird. It's yeah. weird. So, is. Joe and comes a problem. Yeah. So Joe and Leo, you will be roll be both rolling finesse rolls. All to see how this goes down. See, my finesse is good, positive because I'm nimble. Well, that's fine. And mine is just normal. Okay. Oh, I see. Damn! Holy That's... shit! Wait a minute, Joe. How is there two rolls there? Mm. The other one was me uh, rolling to resist uh, Daphne trying to hit Sean. With oh, the chip. that's right. Never mind. Yeah. So eights and eights and twos and twos. Okay. So we will go. Hang on. I got to get back to my slasher thick thing. So we're going to start off with Joe. Mm-hmm. Joe. Mm-hmm. You. Close the nurse's doors behind you, mm-hmm. and you're kind of making um, making up the bed because it's a little bit mashed up from Daphne going a little bit nuts. Um, yeah, this is a good time because because you know Sean, 1980s slasher flick. Mm-hmm. Sean has already established himself to be a little bit of a pervert, so he's um, yeah, he's he's like he's really enjoying. Rolling around in the same sheets that Daphne was rolling around in. So you're creepily smelling the sheets that she was sleeping in. Mm-hmm. And you feel the bed bump. Yeah, it's not you. Hmm. And it bumps again. What the hell? And it bumps harder. And to the ah. point where it knocks you off the bed. Ah. And you notice from underneath it. You see glowing yellow eyes. Oh, what the hell? We got them. And you hear metal scraping on the floor. Uh, we got a freaking raccoon or something. I go and try and turn on the <laughs> Clearly. I go and try and turn on the light. Okay, make me a... What would that be? Um, go do a spirit check for me. Alrighty. That I know is poor. Okay, so the negative for spirit is socially inept. Um, hmm. Really on a fly because he's not exactly doing a social situation right now. Yeah, are, are, you you to charm... to... are you trying to charm yeah, the monster? It... Oh, wait, that's an easy <laughs> thing. Yeah. The spirit check is basically a willpower check to get yourself <laughs> off the floor and quickly to the light switch. So I'll roll a poor stat. Okay. Ooh, that yeah, was two matching. Now, is this your primary or secondary? Mm-hmm. Secondary, right? Secondary. 
Ooh. So the one, so the one actually cancels out one of your matching. So okay. you get no matches. Wait. Yep. Uh, are we looking at the There's thing? No match. I, yeah, there aren't any matches. No one though. Oh, sorry. I was looking at the wrong one. Ah, my chat went all the way to the top. Sorry. Oh, I see. That's my bad. Why did my chat do that? I was looking at an old roll. I apologize. That happens. So no matching. No matching, right? No matching. Okay, so let me see. So, ooh, you lose 1d3 survival points. Okay, I will roll a d3. Do you have any survival points? This is your... Nope! <laughs> you have no survival points. How do I roll a 1d3? Just go r slash or slash r 1d3. That's not the right roll. <laughs> one. Mm. So you're yeah, slightly one dead. Point. Does that take you to negative one survival points? It does take me to negative one, yeah, because at this point, Sean has not been involved with any survival stuff. So, How would you like to describe your character being grabbed and dragged underneath the bed through the hidden compartment? Full on, 100%. Sean gets up like an idiot. Turns his back on the scary thing under the under the cot, and walks toward the light switch. And he just gets to the just gets to he's about to reach the light switch when whoom, it grabs him, pulls his legs. He goes down on his on his face, and then we see two two and a half minutes of like, even though this is nineteen eighty six, like this is a this yes. is this was their big money tech shot. Yes, they've got a night vision camera. So you see 100% in, in like that grainy green, the terror on his face as he is being slowly dragged and motherfucking slowly. Like this thing takes its time because it knows it's got him. So just a little bit at a time. And at one point you can actually see him trying to dig his fingernails into the floor to stop. And then the last thing you see is a metal claw go, I pull him under. Oh, and Sean has disappeared into the ether. And there's not a sign left of any struggle or anything in a nurse's station at all. Mm -hmm. Is it? <laughs> to Leo. Leo, my friend. <laughs> you are having There's some drinks. You are having some drinks in the woods. <laughs> what would you like to do? as you start to hear a familiar scuttling sound. I go, you son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Empowered by alcohol. I love this so much. You gotta come around here messing with me. I'm gonna say that on my way out, when I'm freaking, can I have grabbed a bat? I'm going to... we'll say but we'll say that the that you have found something nice and heavy. Let's say a nice solid chair leg from the from the chair that you ruined. I just could assume that you grabbed one of those. All right. And don't forget you have genre points we can spend, boys and girls. Yep. And survival points in the case of uh in the case of All right. So, do I see him or no? Oh yeah, oh yeah. You see, you see it kind of peeking out from behind a tree, and its head is on one side, but you actually see its clawed arm on the other side. Like it's <laughs> almost like some sort of this weird, discombobulated creature, and it's coming for you. So, what would you like to do? You you, you kind of realize that you found yourself a little bit farther into woods than you had planned. I like to stagger like this a little bit and I go, uh, oh, you messed with the wrong girl at the wrong time. I was getting drunk peacefully. Could have killed anybody else. There's hundreds of kids here. <laughs> but you messed with me. <laughs> and I, Priorities. <laughs> 
and I, um, uh, uh, the alcohol's pushing me because I'm, I'm crazy like that, Jay. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I charge it and and swing out, swing at his head with my thing. Go ahead, make me a nice brawn roll. Normal positive, so yes. Get matching toppers. Ooh. Uh, I didn't get anything. Would you yes. like to spend a genre, uh, three genre points for a re-roll? Ooh, I got five. It's not secondary. Mm-hmm. Hmm. 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 Hard call, oh. eh? No, I don't. I don't think so. You lose a D3 in survival point. Right. So roll yourself a D3. I love the fact that I'm just letting you roll your own destinies at this point. <laughs> <laughs> it, it doesn't seem particularly... Oh. 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 How would you just... How would you like to describe your kind of epic, like, swing and <laughs> hitting metal something? Well, it's, it's like a guy like Jason. I smack him. And it just like breaks, and he just like gives me this look, like, oh. And I realized, oh, I messed up. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That. So oh. How many, how many survival points that leaves you, that Leo? I have one. You have one survival left. You you can still keep on rolling. You're not dead yet. Uh, <laughs> even though I'm not Asian, I'm gonna go. Uh, you know what, Jason? I'm just gonna throw this out there. I'm just gonna start. I'm gonna do this number. I'm gonna bob and weave like a drunken master. Yeah. Go. <laughs> <laughs> gotta go. Go with a smile. Oh no! Oh, oh no! First, so yeah. do you want to try and re-roll one of the ones? You can re-roll the entire roll with oh. three genre points. Oh, for three genre points? Well, I. Daphne, sure, why not? What the heck? I don't care. You don't need them anyway. So, yeah. Uh, uh, try it again, yeah. There you go. Two and threes. Well, there you go. Two, Two matches. Two matches. I don't get rid of my genre points. Uh, hang on. Uh, I'll, steal, I'll steal a couple cards from you. One. Two. How many do you have? Five? Yes. So, there. Okay. There we are. That's why I kind of like to do that. Cool. Nice. I, I kind of wanted to play with the card mechanic, to be honest with you. So is that so I get two to my survival? Yes. So well, no, you get you get one. You get one for one matching pair. I have two. <laughs> well, you have two matching pairs. That is two survival points. So I'm back up three. Yay! <laughs> You're still alive and kicking. And now the audience, the audience is starting to leave the theater because you're now doing Drunken Master, and they did not expect this to be a Bruce Lee movie. <laughs> <laughs> or in this I case, don't care. but but tomorrow and the next day, people are going to it because people are talking. About, Holy shit! There's a Drunken Master scene in the middle of the slasher thing. It's awesome. <laughs> if you survive, you're in the sequel. If you're not, you want to oh, have the sequel. Where did Leo go? God oh damn it! Wow, that's an additional. <laughs> that's an additional two survival points. I think we have our official surviving character right over there. I'm gonna keep going. <laughs> damn! damn. Oh, wow. I think those matching toppers put you over the top, my friend. Daphne, the drunken master. <laughs> <laughs> I know Bon Poo. And I go. And I look over when he's like on the ground. I think, you got to knock the fuck out by there. Oh! And I walk off. <laughs> you notice, you know, that Daphne notices as she like takes her final swing and knocks it to the ground and walks away. <laughs> Which I love so much. Uh, you notice it actually splits in two as you walk away. Nice. 
And if you look over your shoulder, you notice the two pieces start to reform themselves. All right. Well, I'm going to say that she doesn't notice it. Okay. The audience yeah. sees it. The audience sees it. Yeah. yeah. Okay. No, she's Much looking pretty it. pleased with herself, man. <laughs> she's got a swagger the whole nine yards, man. So, anyways, I, I survived again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm trying to How kill myself, Jason. The... I swear. <laughs> yeah. How many times does a secondary character need to survive before they become a primary character? Uh, oh no, she's effectively a primary character. To be honest with you, this first the two at this point is so awesome. <laughs> <laughs> so we are now. We're going to assume that Daphne kind of wanders back to camp. Mm-hmm. Are you even going to bother telling anybody anymore? Are you now, like, basically now into, like, fuck it, this is Vietnam? <laughs> <laughs> I, I go... On. Yeah, I go back to uh, where... If, 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 where I crawl into Shaggy's bed. Oh, okay. Yay, Shaggy! Because <laughs> I'm drunk, and I want to cuddle with somebody right now. A little pissed off. And who's a better person to cuddle with than somebody named Shaggy? Yeah. 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 Wow, I thought this was a dream. Bonus. Bonus. And then I go, oh, I don't think this is a dream. And uh, of course, uh, you see me move down the down where his legs are. <laughs> is this a dream? <laughs> yeah, and you just... just... See, you know, like a close up on, on uh, his expression. He's all... <laughs> <laughs> oh. The movie, the movie cuts to 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 to, uh, to 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 a scene just over the water by the by the lake, and there's one lone tree standing by itself. <laughs> Because uh, <laughs> it's 1980s, yes. we can't show the sex. We yeah. can't show we can yeah. show naked gun sex, but we can't show real sex. Nope. <laughs> no, no. What you should do is you should show a train going across the railroads. There's no train. Yeah. Or the tunnel. <laughs> the tunnel. Yes. All right. No, that's way too naked gun. All right. So, so that was awesome. Morning comes. You're missing a crew member. Chad is up at six but, in the morning and Chad does that. Ooh, Chad, make me a brains roll. That's not gonna happen. But okay. <laughs> Do you have anything positive or negative on your brain? <clears throat> brains is negative, somewhat oblivious. <laughs> Shit, you're rolling as a negative. Wow. Chad might have noticed something with the three of us. That's four dice. Did I get the negative wrong? No, it's called. There's no actual one that says negative quality or normal. There should be. Your... No, there isn't, man. Mm. Should be. Normal. Good stat. Good stat. Negative quality. Good stat. Positive quality. Normal stat. Normal stat. Positive quality. Poor stat. There's, there's, no, stat. Native, there's, there's native, no native. There's no native stat. Negative quality. Oh, quality. I thought I added that stupid thing. Hang on. Is it is it marked as um available under oh, under uh, token action? Uh, it should be. Uh, normal, normal, normal. Oh, I thought I added it. Maybe we lost it during our nonsense. Last die and we keep going, man, if it's only three dice. So that means I only get a pair of fives. Pair of fives will do me. Hang on. I want to add that, though, because I don't know about that. Because I could have sworn I added it. Uh, pissing off that it's not there. No worries, man. I must, have, I must have forgot to save it. So that is normal stat negative, right? Normal stat negative. Is that the one I'm missing? Normal stat negative? Yes. God damn it. I could have sworn I had it in there. I apologize. Yeah, it's that, that, it's that negative quality. Good stat. I could have sworn I added it. Hang on. You have good two good stat negative qualities. And one oh, good do stat I? positive quality. Yeah, that's uh, what I see right now. Uh, I must have did it wrong. <laughs> Hang on. That one's okay. Oh, by the way, Jason, am I still supposed to be on the uh, the screen with the picture of my boss? Oh, hang on. Yeah, I'll get you guys off that. There's going to be one second. So I'm missing normal negative, right? Yes. Normal yeah. negative. I think I just labeled it wrong, I think. All right, let's try that. Did I catch them all now? <coughs> Maybe. Maybe. 
Normal snap negative should be 3d8? Yes. Okay, then yeah, you got it right. Okay. God damn it. Anyways, so Chris? Yep. You notice that you're missing one of your kids. My counselor sense. Chad must go find the child. Guess Let's wake who? up the other counselors and find out what happened. Is yes. it the one that's crippled? Because that would tell me to act. Guess, guess who you're missing. Of course you're missing Marty. He's the only kid we gave a name to. Marty! <laughs> no! Where's Marty? Have you seen Marty? Chad, wake up! Where's Marty? Ah, uh, damn it. Which one's Marty again? The small, differently abled kid. Oh, yeah. I don't know. He's not in bed with me, man. Come on. That's a good thing, Buster. I agree. Okay. God, all right. Come on. Give me a second. Let me get some coffee. Oh, or something. We have to find Marty. Uh, I oh. sure. Quick, quick visual gag. This is when Chad finds out that Chet sleeps in the naked. Sleeps yes. naked. When he blows off the covers. <laughs> ah. I did not need to know this. Chad did not need to know this. Of course, it's only naked. It's only, it's only naked. Uh, naked from the waist up, so it's no, no. really the focus weird. on Chad's face going. <laughs> <laughs> so, Leo, what were you going to say? Uh, Daphne perks up from his. They're in the uh, men's sleeping area, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I I perk up from uh, Shaggy's covers and go. Guys, can you like keep it down, like totally, and like put away your little pencil dick because like no one's impressed by that. And I just go back to bed. Everybody's impressed by whip Chad. <laughs> <laughs> this is not Porky's. No, really. <laughs> it's not Porky's. We Chad, will. Chad, is, Chad totally has this moment of like looking at Daphne, <laughs> looking over at Shaggy. Looking back at Daphne, looking over at Shaggy. Yeah, what dude. The F? <laughs> that happened. That has got to be some really good week. Hey, we'll oh, talk okay. about your sex around here later. We need to find Marty. All right, yeah, 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 yeah. Marty. All right, kid, 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 kid. Okay, come Marty. on, let's go. Yeah. Differently able kid that must be rescued. Oh, yeah, that one. Oh. When you... Uh, yeah. Let's go find. Let's go find Red. He probably seen something. So, does yeah. Daphne ever mention that she came across a uh, thing again and fought it, or uh, any of that, or she doesn't even want to dwell on that? She, she's, you know, and she was drunk at the time, so she thought she, she, she's like, yeah, okay, <laughs> to keep to keep the illusion. Otherwise, I think Daphne would be the kind of person to be like, I'm, I'm leaving. <laughs> mm. I just go on like, yeah. She's like, fuck it. I can take it down now. Whatever. You want a piece of me? Maybe she's like Sean. Well, like Sean tried to grope me last night, and I taught a lesson. You don't touch girls that don't want to touch you back. So he might be out for the count. I don't know where he's at. Well, if I see him, I'll I'll, I'll totally beat him up too because that's not cool. So <laughs> you don't have to be like my like savior or anything, but. That's cool. Yeah, yeah, I know. You, you can take care of yourself. I, I, you know, I, I'm liberated. <laughs> <laughs> I'm an 80s guy. Oh, we, we got our Valentine's connection. Oh, it's the sweetest weird good. thing ever. I'm so sad that it's going to end in tears. So, um, Chris... Yo. Are you dragging them all to go find our Indian friend? Absolutely, because we need to use the buddy system. <laughs> Daphne's not going to leave. Okay, that sounds fine. <laughs> Daphne's Daphne's Daphne is at her moment in the light, sunlight light. Okay, so Brad, mm -hmm. are, is Shaggy going to go? Oh, find his little kid? Yeah, or doesn't really care. Well, he doesn't give a damn. But, or I mean, if there's like peer pressure, if they're like, no, you gotta help help us find this kid, then... Oh god, Chad on. is so peer pressuring the hell out of him. Chad is a good man for your pressure army. Hang on, because this, this is the problem about this game, is making sure we balance on, on uh, 
how many characters we use because we've been definitely leaving out Leo's main character, which is hilarious. So the question becomes, did you want Velma to go along because it makes more narrative sense? I yeah, yeah, with... yeah, let's do that instead. I mean, yeah, yeah, Velma would totally help find the, yeah. the missing kid. So we will we will then say Chad is gathering as many people as possible, noticing that there is no Sean, which might be worrying. Has anybody seen Sean? <laughs> no. No, not since last night. Yeah. Hmm. Wasn't he and his uh, his buddy Murray doing patrol or something? Yeah. So. I hear back in, in back of uh, chat again <laughs> and go, I sense a, a, a wrestling of wins. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Red, how you doing? <laughs> Yeah, er everybody's like, yeah, everybody's like, hi, and Chad's like, <gasps> <laughs> you give me a heart attack if I wasn't so manly. So should we search the uh, search the buildings or or the forest? Mm. Yes. Well, that's, hang that's on, it. hang on. Our native guide, because he knows the area, might have a map. I now have an excuse to use my map. Yay! Chet, like Chet, by the way, is, is totally lighting up a cigarette. I let you. I where, let you. Okay, seen where's the last time you? I go. Where is the last time we you seen Sean? I shall track him from the last location. He's an adult. He can take care of himself. I'm more concerned about Marty. There's a small crippled kid in the woods. That's not cool, man. Where is this Marty sleep? He was in that building over there. Mm. So be a real American and take a stand. All right, so I'll use my brain. <laughs> Good, positive, and tracky. Yes, awesome. And of course, it's going to be very racist. I'm going to be like doing this number to the ground, like <laughs> head to the ground, and I sprinkle dust into the air like this. Like wave a feather in the air, <laughs> and of course, Chad is watching with an absolute fascination over this character, like an eight-year-old child. Okay, go ahead, make your roll, Leo. Ooh, <laughs> look at those slimes! Holy crap! No, that is a pretty good result. Yeah, you kind of notice that um, that there doesn't seem to be any struggle from uh the cabin where marty was um his bed is definitely not made right and they all chris could tell you that the little kid actually became pretty obsessed of trying to impress him so he'd make his bed every day kind of thing bounce a quarter off the things yeah now i know and, Marty. And, but you also notice that on the deck of the stairs that go into it there is like almost like somebody's taking a knife and stab a knife on each stair. But it's not like somebody's taking a knife like this. It's like somebody was walking on knives coming down the stairs. And you do notice that it kind of goes off onto the hiking trail to the north that goes past number nine. Number nine is the staff housing. So it actually goes back up and through where everybody is supposed to sleep. Okay. Which is right the there. The spirits tell me that he has traveled this way. And I'm mm. that direction. Okay. A, a creature Look. that stands on pointing, uh, pointing hooves. A creature that's, okay, whatever. Guys, okay. I don't think I yeah. like this. There, you, you see those holes in the, in the wood, right? That, those weren't there before. Mm. You know, honestly, that's probably a couple of my kids just messing around. Look. With knives? Yeah, it's summer camp. Call yourself a counselor. It's summer With camp. knives? <laughs> that's not approved. Yeah. That's, that doesn't sound safe. <laughs> it's so, summer camp. What would you guys like to do? Uh -huh. You've got a med kit, it's fine. I'm going to grab the biggest thing I can find that I can use as a heavy object weapon. 
All right, look. Sure Marty's in trouble. The main thing what? is we don't tell butt liquor, right? Yeah. None of us want to get in trouble for this. <laughs> is everybody going to go along with this? Don't Dad tell Dad is on the tip of his tongue. He thinks about it. He remembers what happened to Daphne. And he nods defeated. <laughs> Again, he's I, so straight edge nowadays. He's not Leo, even... Brad, do you agree with this idea? I don't know. Um, I, might... I think I need to let. Uh... It's not actually butt liquor. It's. Uh... <laughs> We're just gonna call him butt liquor for okay. now. That's fine. I don't care anymore. Yeah. Oh, no, that's butt yeah. liquor. Burk I... liquor. I I don't. I, I think I might need to let Mr. Berklicker know that uh, you're giving the, the kids knives. That that doesn't sound right at all. I'm sorry. I, I don't I don't mean to be like a a, a well, tale or anything. It's just and you know, Shaggy, that's totally fair. No, just so like this, I'm this is not probably going to have to tell Berklicker about Daphne in your bed. No, no. Um, this is Velma. This is Velma. Ve yeah. Oh, this is Velma. Care. This is Shaggy. Don't care. It's Velma. Oh, sorry. I forgot who's with us right now. Yes. Honey. I Velma, I get what you're saying. Whoops. I hear what you're saying. Go away. You're a smart girl. Let me put it to you this way. Do you really want to make the group of kids who we've already established are playing with knives mad at you? <laughs> wow there that's is the line of the night nature. boys and girls <laughs> wow look i well, can only do so much as a counselor right i can't control them it's not like i would encourage him to murder you but <laughs> okay no that's i just that's... encourage them to slash up your bed in the middle of the night i wouldn't encourage them to murder you right? well i mean I uh, okay. I, I don't want them to be disappointed and, and feel like there there's like uh, like different camp counselors are telling them different things. But uh, but I don't want them to get hurt. If they're running around with oh. knives, they could get hurt. I'm sorry. I should have said when I meant knives, I meant like plastic, fake knives. You know. Safety knives. Knives that are not going to get hurt with. <laughs> okay. Oh. Oh. Oh, you had me worried. Yeah, sorry. That's my fault. I should have explained. Okay. okay. So I was holding... Uh, sorry. Go, uh, go ahead. Go ahead. go ahead. Well, basically, as soon as he started threatening kids, I was holding onto a, like, the side of a fence. That roll was my body check. Oh, I broke the fucker. <laughs> <laughs> Crack. <laughs> He's not threatening kids. You don't, you don't threaten children, man. You don't threaten women. That's just not cool. And I'm, I'm not threatening women or kids. I'm just, you know. You know? Okay, yeah. we settled it. Velma and I settled it. It's fine, Chad. Calm down. <laughs> All right. I got Chad's got his eye on you, man. Let, let's, like, yeah. let's just find yeah, Marty. Yeah, I'll, I'll keep that in mind. <laughs> let's just find hey, right. uh, Marty. Should we, should we split up to cover more territory? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I will make the decision easy. If you follow, I'm going to assume that Red is going to take you guys up the hiking trail, following the tracks. Mm -hmm. And when you reach here, do you see the little split right there? Uh huh. The trail suddenly breaks into two. One going into the devil's land, and that's not a bad place at all. And <laughs> the other one continuing around to the other side. Which trail is the kids? You don't know. You can't tell. There's little na there's little knife trails going in both directions this way. Those are the ones that you're tracking from Marty's place. Hmm. Hey, Velma, do you want to, like, come with me and check out the ones that are going that way? And Red and Chad, you guys can go the other way? Okay, that sounds good. Okay. That, so that who's going smart. where? <laughs> <laughs> you better yeah, come to one piece, man. Okay, so, yeah. Red is not going to go into the devil's land. He's like, I feel bad mojo that way. 
Okay, so yeah. you go up north. Yeah. Okay. And I'm apparently going with uh, Red Feather because I'm kind of fascinated. Sounds by like good. You're gonna go with Red Ferret. Mm -hmm. Okay. I want my zone so. point. Okay. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. I will give you your <laughs> damn really drop point. point. <laughs> I am sorry. I will give you your drop <laughs> okay. point. Are you happy? I'm happy. I'm gonna add start adding <laughs> cards to my. I'm deck. happier. Happier. Okay. So we will uh, work it this way. What pair wants to go first? And try not to talk over each other so I can understand everybody. <laughs> so which pair would like to go first? I'll let you choose. Whereas in roll. Yeah, let Chad and Velma go first, and then we'll do the other one. Okay. Okay. Like Devil's Land, therefore, more interesting area. You Devil's guys Land. go into Devil's Land. Devil's Land, I couldn't quite find a description of it, but I can go get a description of it. Well, I'm sure it's a happy Devil's place. Land is, well, Devil's Land is a. Wow. Ooh, that's a good sound for Devil's Land. Uh, Devil's Land. Bear sound. Yeah, Devil's Land is um, definitely one of those dark places. It's quite claustrophobic when it comes to um, to how the forest feels. Like it even seems like kind of daytime and dark. It's also rocky, scraggly. Definitely something like out of the Beer Blair Witch Project. <sighs> I'd like you to both make spirit checks to start off with. Uh, does willpower aid in this? Um, not quite. Uh, what else do you have? Do you have any other positives, either one of you? Willpower, I'm not quite sure, because you're not really scared at this point. We're willing to something... Uh, Okay, so I am both, uh, I have both a responsible nature and I'm naive. <laughs> oh, that is an awesome combo nation. I'm not sure how to do that. Oh. It's also a great pick for Velma, by the way. So, it is. <laughs> let me, um, let me get you guys to roll spirit checks, both of you at normal. Uh, I don't have the dice to... Uh, yeah. Oh, we, I apologize. Dice. It's hard to keep track of everything. Oh, no, worries. I know. no, do not drag and drop the kill. If you go to AA basic rolls, they're there, Joe. No. And, okay. of course, guess what Jason oh, did? It's Hang behind on. The... Hang on. <laughs> I put everything on the token map because I'm an idiot. Okay. <laughs> there we are. That's not on the token layer anymore. Okay, so for Chet, that is... So that's just going to be a good Good yeah. stat. Yeah, straight roll. Okay. Uh, and given that is no pairs. Okay. And uh, do I roll it as just normal, or, or do uh, uh, like neither kick in or both kick in, or one or the other? I, I, no, I, I I think just roll normal. Okay. Or roll whatever your is. Oh, hey, oh, there's a matching. There's some matching pairs yeah. right there. Okay. Nice. Velma is full of spirit. So, so Velma prevents you, Chet, from mm -hmm. wandering off too far off the beaten track. Okay. She's kind of keeping you on whatever tiny little trail there is here because it's not very good. You know, Velma, dorky chicks like you turn me on too. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, are we gonna make out in the woods? No, not not with that. <laughs> We're not. Come on, I'll give you drawer points. She, awesome. uh, oh no no, she she gives uh um uh, him a a a look. I I don't want to uh leave Marty behind, but maybe I should just go back. If you're gonna be like that. What? Look, let's just keep, let's just go down down these trails just a little bit longer. He definitely didn't come this way. I mean, what kid's going to wander through these woods? But we can at least say we looked, then we can go back, wait for the others. They'll find him. We'll be okay. Okay. Just don't get all handy. No, no, of course not. 
Oh, <laughs> uh-huh, you know. <laughs> I'm just saying, if you wanted to, well, I'm available. I'm sure you are. <laughs> we will. Lacking in social grace. <laughs> yes, <Yep>. you are. <laughs> yes, I am. <laughs> we will get back to smooth. <laughs> I'll make sure I put everything on the layers they're supposed to be. Oh my god, I put all my map stuff on the token layers. That's so stupid of me. I apologize. So, <laughs> we'll get back to Chris and Red. Chris and Red, you are following the trail up north. Let me get you back to there. Awesome. Okay. So you're successfully, and you notice that it starts to, I didn't mark it, but you see where it says the finger? Mm-hmm. Yes. You guys actually walk a couple hours. You're making good time because you're, you're pretty, um, you're, you're pretty both in shape. Mm-hmm. So you make your way to the finger and you notice that there is another trail that I forgot to draw. So I'll draw it right now. Okay. There's another little trail that leads up this way. It's kind of like a little scratchy. Like it's a little bit of lower place. And that is where the trail of footprints go. Or footprints as the case may be. Mm. Yes, I see. these are the direction they go. Chad, you are strong. We shall you have a strong spirit, I sense. We shall go into find this boy and save him from the great evil that has befallen this area. Chad agreed. <laughs> Chad, <laughs> ass from here to Saigon. Woo, I'm getting oh, a lot of echo. Yeah. yeah. Okay. For me? Um, more from Chris. Sorry. So we follow the path. Okay. Yeah, basically, yeah, I got the full. Well, yeah. It's on like Donkey Kong. I got my post hole in my hands. If I see something, I'm going to whack it with a stick. If it scares me, I'm going to run like a chicken, but we'll see what happens. Hang on. I need to drag Gotta you. Somewhere. Got to drag you somewhere new. Um, can uh, Red? What uh, would you like to do, Leo? With my hunting knife. Yes. I would like to make a spear for my buddy, Chad. I, I, will, will. I will totally allow that. Okay. Yeah, because again, Chad is rich, man. He's probably one of the most powerfully built people in the camp. I, I I take my feather and I go, You're a mighty warrior now. If you die, <laughs> if you die here, you will go to the spirit realm and the great spirit will take your body. And I put a like a black, you know, thing under his eyes. I guess. Uh, yes. He's got the <laughs> smile face. I am honored to be blessed by a real American. So my question mm-hmm. is, before you guys go into the house, yeah, <laughs> because this is what you find in the woods, is this. Mm-hmm. Did we want to call it the night? This is actually a great place for to be continued, to be honest with you. Yeah. 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 Because we Red. started late. I, if it's okay with Brad, if, can we go up for another hour? This is this, um, this is going to be up to Chris because Chris is the one who has to get up in okay. like at five. I'm so sorry, but I got to be up at four in the morning. Okay, yeah, no problem. <laughs> um, and is there that figure in the window? Yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> because of course there is. That's why I picked it for because it's awesomely creepy. Um, uh, So we okay, okay ending so, for here tonight? Yeah. Or is it too yeah. early, Brad? No, no, it's fine. Sure. Okay, cool. It's, it's, that is a good point. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. that way we should be able to get a full session next week as well, or at least most nice. of the full session next week, if we split it off here. Because you you guys are about, uh, I want to say about three quarters into it by now. 
Oh, okay. So more people need to die. That's. Oh, I'm going to have to do some work. I might actually have to read up on part two at this point. You guys are surviving way too much. Mm -hmm. You only killed one character. Like we've had a secondary character. Like like, oh yeah, no problems. I'm just going to hit the monster down. <laughs> <laughs> To beat the shit out of it. What do you mean you just killed Cthulhu? <laughs> <laughs> Which what I love killed? because it's like, it's like, yeah, like, oh no, you gotta roll a bunch of toppers to like, to, to, to like, this, like, this barely disable it. Oh no, no, I'm rolling maxes. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> this is so funny. Continually. Oh, okay. So, yes, I think we should end it there and we will find out next week. What happened to Marty? <laughs> Who might die next? Marty how, will be a bit, say Chad. And how many people will Shaggy and Chet sleep with? <laughs> <laughs> and will they eventually sleep with each other? So, <laughs> that is where we're going to go next week. Well, Shaggy's only one, so. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so next oh. <laughs> We'll, we'll find that out need to be if extra? there is enough weed in the world for that to happen. <laughs> uh, uh, oh, man. So, uh, who would like to tell people where they can be found on the internet and what they're up to? And stuff. I'll do it. Okay, as you know, Jay and I wrote a book. It involves minotaurs and possibly Scottish. Oh. And there's basically elements here. We wrote a really awesome game that the Minotaurs play that mostly involves swords and large balls. I'll let you guys figure it out. Not that I, kind of balls. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is, yeah, let's try to get <laughs> Minotaur balls. The dinosaur thing, which we're using the other thing here. Um, RPG Circus I co-host on in order to do so here. We just had an episode last week. Uh, my personal blog and the D-Rev RPG blog thingy here. And of course, if you get a hold of me, here's my Twitter and my email account. We're more than happy to hear questions. If you have anything you want us to do or not do or enjoy or find out what actually did happen and suggestions for the next part, let us know and we'll be more than happy to entertain you in some way, shape, or form. That's pretty much it for me. I know what's happening in the next part, so don't make any suggestions. Um, other than to maybe kill, other than to maybe kill them quicker. I know, I know. I'm Murder trying, them faster. I'm trying really, really hard. Uh, you can to the point on, of the movie where the deaths are going to start coming hot and heavy. It's it's perfect. Yes. You can catch me on uh, my blog, which I should maybe update at some point. Um, Twitter, uh, qual at Quasal16 on uh, Twitter. That's Q-U-A-Z-A-L, uh, number 16. You can also uh, look for me on Amazon for Death Race Against the Patriarchy. So, anything else, me and Chris will work on. I might be running a lot more Slasher Flick and using it for other things. <laughs> well, we will see. I'm enjoying the mechanics of the system. It's yes. nice and juicy yet simple mm -hmm. let's go to leo uh, leo yes uh you can follow me at wizard garner when i'm uh on twitter i update that all the time with uh, any stuff that's been going on uh we just did a pathfinder game a couple of characters died unfortunately so oh, oh dear <laughs> Um, so, um, but enjoy that. Sh I will update that with the new, uh, that, uh, new episode. So if you're watching our, um, adventures there, and of course you can catch me here every Sunday, Friday, we're going to do that, uh, finish the Mist of Akuma. With oh, yes. Yep. Mm -hmm. oh, God, yeah. And, um, definitely looking forward to seeing which one of my characters is going to lit, is going to die first? Because both of them <laughs> seem to be pretty badass at this point. It's so <laughs> bad. Uh, good deal. Uh, so, and Joe, do you have any shoutouts? I'm looking forward to this Friday, Mists of Akuma, and being my um, fire drunken master 
Luke Kang, Stone Cold, Steve Austin, badass crow dude. I'm looking forward to that. <laughs> uh, so uh, thank you, everybody. Uh, Jay, thank you for running. Thank you. Uh, Amazing. I'll be, yeah. uh, I'll be back on uh, Wednesday at 10 a.m. Pacific uh, for The Burning Wind, which is uh, uh, set in Patrick Rothfuss's uh, King Killer Chronicles using the uh, burning wheel system. Uh, and then, uh, as has been mentioned, on Friday at uh, 5 p.m. Pacific, uh, we'll be uh, continuing with uh, Mist of Akuma. Mm -hmm. And, and there will be oh. uh, uh, much martial arts fighting, and, and, uh, and uh, there will be many Oni, and it'll be cool. Uh, and yes. then, uh, on Saturday, I will continue to uh, uh, hack Infinity, and uh, that probably won't be as, as cool, but it, it's coming along. Um, and then we'll be back here uh, for more Slasher Flick uh, at uh, 4 p.m. Mm -hmm. next Sunday. And hopefully my computer won't go kablooey uh, eating an hour. Hopefully not, yeah. Um, so, uh, thanks again, everybody. Uh, have a good one. Peace out, everybody. Yep. Bye. Chat approved. Bye. <laughs>